This is the uh, microphone. You can see here on the bottom, this looks like a volume adjustment, as well as a little headphone jack and the USB-C port for power. Today back with a first for Big C Vlogs. I've made a lot of videos over the years, but I've never made a video on a microphone. This is a condenser microphone, which would be great for like a podcast, streaming, gaming, something like that. But I've never had one of these microphones until now. So special thanks to this company, who was nice enough to send me this VM30 condenser microphone. We're of course gonna go through the unboxing and then I'm gonna plug this into a computer and I'm gonna do some audio video clips with this microphone. So I'm gonna do some comparisons so you can hear the difference between the mics on my computer and this microphone. So click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch. And let's check out this condenser microphone. All right, so let's open up our VM30 condenser microphone. Nice company logo here. Thanks again to them for sending it to us. Company info, all of your model information, as well as the specs. It's a plug and play and has clear sound. And then that's just the sticker and company logo there. So let's open it up without further ado. My first condenser microphone. Wow, nice user's manual right on top with tons of details like that. Then look at that, it comes with a, oh, it has a split. Okay, I see. So this side, I guess, is for USB regular or USB-C, and this side's USB-C that goes into the mic. And then uh, in here, the microphone, very nice. Is there anything else? No, that's it for the box. So this is the uh, microphone. You can see here on the bottom, this looks like a volume adjustment as well as a little headphone jack and the USB-C port for power. Now, if I loosen this, I can then bring this around like so. I can re-tighten it. And then I've got my feet here to set up the microphone. And I mean, a physical mute button right on the front. Looks like it actually has a light, so that's really nice. The stand feels good and sturdy. I mean, if you're uh, doing a voiceover or recording for a streaming channel, this would be perfect. You're able to set it right on your desk, run your cable around. Yeah, actually, a little bit of a demonstration. Let's see how long this cable is. So I'm 5'8", and this goes just over my head, so I'd say this is just over a six-foot cable. Love this blue look. Same here. If we plug this in, we'll then be able, you know, just have it ran around wherever it plugged into your computer at. So it'd be nice and easy for doing a podcast, for doing a streaming show, etc. So I think we're gonna get on, uh, we might try it on the M2, just because the M2 has a little bit better uh, microphones than my M1 iMac. And then we'll plug this in, make this the default, and uh, record a clip with this microphone as well. Let's do that now. So we're gonna log in to our M2 MacBook Air. All right, so this is a recording directly from my M2 MacBook Air with absolutely no editing done to the sound whatsoever. So now we're gonna take our microphone. I really need to fix that. And we'll plug our microphone in and see how different the audio quality is. So here's an M2 MacBook Air natural audio test. And here's what it sounds like on this mic. So as I had mentioned, this had a uh, dual USB port here. So if you're using a Windows PC and you have a regular USB port, you could use this plug. If you're like me on this M2 MacBook Air and only have USB-C, then, well, you're going to use the USB-C side. Uh, set it here. There we go. And then plug in our USB-C cable. And there it is. If you want this accessory to connect, we'll click Allow. Now we have a nice microphone here. The blue light, if I click it, it goes red. So that must be muted and unmuted. So now let's do another test. We will open back up QuickTime Player. When you move your recording, and then we'll go into our settings here. And there you can see we're gonna pick this device. So now our audio should be coming from this. And uh, let's click record. All right, so now the sound you're hearing is coming from this microphone. So you should hopefully be able to hear much better sound quality coming from this condenser mic than uh, what the MacBook Air M2 is able to do by itself. Now, of course, I have the mic maybe a foot away from my face. It has a nice uh, splash guard, depending on what you want to call it, pop filter. I call them pop filters. Some people call them splash guards. It just kind of depends. But if I talk directly into it, like if I was trying to do a voiceover or something like that, or 
was talking closer to it for streaming. At the end of the day, hopefully it sounds good. I'll know uh, in a moment, I guess, when I stop recording, because as of now, I have no clue the difference in how this sounds. So let me play these videos back and see how the video quality is from this condenser microphone. Recording, because as of now, I have no clue the difference in how this sounds. So better sound quality coming from this condenser mic than uh, what the MacBook Air M2 is able to do by its. And we'll plug our microphone in and see how different the audio quality is. So to be honest, that'll do it for this condenser microphone. Sorry, I guess I held it maybe a little too close to my face. That made a, a lot of that uh, popping noise there. But to be 100% honest, I was expecting it to sound as good as it did. And uh, it sounds really amazing. I mean, you could truly almost record music on this thing. If you're in a proper room with proper uh, soundproofing, this could be used to make music. You can use it for your streaming. You can use it for your YouTube videos. You can use it for your voiceovers. You can use it for whatever you may need but it does have some really, really clear sound quality in comparison to what you get from a standard M2 MacBook Air. So I gotta say, two big thumbs up. Love the size, love the stand, love the compactness, love the cables design, having a regular USB-A and a USB-C. All around, a great USB condenser microphone, perfect for your PC. Conferences too, I mean, this would be really good for conferences, people would be able to hear you clear. That's another, uh, another benefit. So of course, I'll have this exact condenser microphone link down below in my description if you'd like to grab one for yourself and that should do it for today's video click like click subscribe indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch and we'll see you in the next one deuces